Hey everybody, welcome to the Warhammer Age of Sigmar Battle Report. I'm back with Owen from Game with the Cooler, and he is bringing his Grotcast. Uh, wait, no. Grot. Grottron Overlord. Overgrots? Caradron Overgrots? It's Caradron Overgrots. The, the Pyre Goblins. <laughs> to fight my um, new Stormcast journalist using the well, Wardens of the Stormkeep. The Stormkeep sort of like, bat not battalion, almost like allegiance trait, or places your normal like traits for your army. Uh, to try and make Liberators great again, and Judicators great again, and all the Paladins great again. So we'll show you the armies. Are playing 1750. We'll roll permission from General's Handbook 2020, and we'll get this underway. My Storm Keep. Uh, I have two battalions, and all of my models are in them. So first of all, I've got the Wardens of the Storm Keep. It's a Lord Celestant, uh, and then he's got two other Stormcast heroes. He's got a Knight Incantor and a Lord Celest uh, Lord Castellant, uh, hanging out with him. Uh, and then their bonuses on a 2 plus each hero face, he gets an extra CP, and on a 5 plus each of them do. Then I've got my Storm Tower Garrison, led by the Knight Vexilor here. It was the last time I used saw the table. It's been a minute. Uh, and that's giving me uh, my battle line. So I've got a unit of Adjudicators with Shockbow Bulls and a Prime, a uh, 10 man unit of Liberators with uh, two Grand Hammers, and a 10 man unit with two Grand Blades, and then two Paladin units. Uh, I'm using Protectors and Retributors. All in the battalion. Now what the battalion does, it gives the Paladins and the Judicators the ability to forfeit their movement for plus one hit and plus one saves as well. That doesn't prevent pile-ins, it's just if I forfeit my movement during the movement phase. I can't be set up or um, move, I get that plus one to hit and plus one to saves. Everybody gets plus one bravery if they're within 12 any Liberators, because they're just so darn shiny and inspiring. Uh, and it's worth noting these are going to be Celestial Vindicators today. Uh, so they reroll hits of one for attacks made when they charge. Uh, they get Righteous Hatred, so they can basically, within 9 of a hero or 18 of a general for a CP, get plus 1 their melee attacks. Uh, and then my General over here is going to have Single Minded Fury. Uh, his unmodified 6s to hit get plus 1 damage. And Storm Range Blade for his Tempestus Hammer. He can have plus 2 attacks, but minus 1 save. The trade is if he gets hit by a damage uh, higher than 1 weapon on a 5+, plus, it's changed to damage 1. And then uh, my extra Spell Lore, we're going to take the old Storm Collar and the Incantor. Uh, and the last bits are the, that was his mount trait, and I got two more relics. A mirror shield on the Lord Castellant, uh, which will give him minus two to hit from shooting. Another faux torque for the Knight in Cantor, where you reroll successful hit rolls for, uh, the target the bear for models that can fly. And over here, we've uh, got no battalion, still one battalion? Yeah, no one battalion. Still battalion, yeah. Um, battalion is the Sky Escorts, or Gunstock Escorts. Uh, ironclad plus the two escort ships and my one unit with the half naked goblin uh, thunderers <laughs> makes up that team. We have we're playing Barak Nar, so my thunderers count as battle line. Um, the ironclad has a great sky hook attached to it, and then the upgrade we gave it was the deal breaker battle ram, so he's all in on charging. And then the one uh, spider escort has the collapsible compartments. Um, mm -hmm. We've taken the default Baraknar artifact and command abilities to ignore battle shock and choose a dice outcome on my uh, my little Capitan. And then my engine masker took uh, seismic shock gauntlets. So when he charges, pick an enemy unit within one inch on a two up. They take D three mortal wounds. And that is the whole ba gang. And what are your great workings? Sorry, uh, the great work, the the, the battle ram, ram on the right, and, and then carry people. Yeah. Give me a table for a mission. Six. Six, and then battle plan four. four. The Blade's Edge. This is six objectives. At the start of each battle round, you can lock out an objective um, after the first. The player taking the second turn removes basically one of the six. Uh, it is alternating deployment 12 inches from enemy territory, with table halves being the, the territories, A and B. And then major victory uh, after five rounds if you have more VPs than your opponent. Deployments. Uh, we've got our six zones out here. I've only got two drafts because my battalions. One to four, so... Uh, you can deploy first, I guess, or I can deploy first. And we're deployed. So for me, I've got Retributors, 10 Liberators, uh, Knight and Cantor, uh, Knight Vexilor, then my Judicators, my uh, Castellant with my single Griff Hound who deploys with him, uh, Lord Selson on Dracoth, more Liberators, and then over here is the Retributors, or sorry, the Protectors. Got Team uh, Rifleman in front, Rifleman in front, uh, one Rifleman unit, the one that's got the bonuses embarked on the... Um, Compartment escort. gunboat, yep. Yeah. Escort. And then escort. And main one with the two officers inside. And then where are all your engineers in the sky? Oh yeah, I should probably deploy that. 
<laughs> oh yeah, Skyhook guys. I forgot they were in the army. Forgot they existed. Right, done. Uh, so start of the first battle round, I've chosen to go first. We are at zero, zero. Uh, and let's do some hero phase stuff. Let's just cast that spell. Let's just try and hit the whole battlefield with some lightning. Uh, we're gonna do the big old storm for that Encantor. Seven, I think that goes off. 11, no, 12. Uh, and we're looking for some first turn. Uh, you're gonna shoot me a bit. That's all I can do about it. So a warding lantern, the central unit of liberators, because why not? We all go get in position, because we gotta get on these zones, otherwise you're gonna start locking them out. So uh, let's go with liberators, and they're gonna run. And they're gonna go 12. Right, I go 11. Uh, they go 10. But we'll do liberators first. Uh, and we're gonna go eight and then three more. Start rounding up some zones. And he's gonna go left. We're gonna stand in both zones. And the prime. And we'll go this way. And the retributors, they're gonna go six. They're gonna go four. Basically halfway up the zone. Yep. Into the middle, basically. Four. She goes 11. She'll go central. Hit over here. Xalor. He'll run. And go seven. In the zone. Uh, we'll go with the Dracoth Lord. He'll run. And go basically wherever he wants, but he'll hang it over here. Senior Liberators is going to get their thing set to a six and go 11. That's me a CP. Oh, I forgot to roll. Two plus CP for my general. Yes, uh, my two heroes on fives. Yes, so I actually have two back. <laughs> so I still have three. I had five. And they'll go 11, so to the middle of the zone. And him. He goes 10. Go in the middle of the unit. Uh, Bark Bark the Griffhand. He goes eight. Uh, he might go faster than that, actually. Yeah, she has 11. Sweet. Uh, he'll go hang out over here. Guys, they go six. And go body the zone. Actually, you know what? He's gonna go back here just to zone everything out. He's gonna show up behind me. Uh, and these guys are just gonna touch the zone and wait for you to show up. Don't have any because you're not within 24. Uh, combat don't have any because I'm not in charge range and I ran with everybody. So it's already three. The three zones because I'm not fast enough to get anywhere else. And you go to two CVs, roll for your friends, CV the extra ones. Four pluses. Yes, no. Go to three. The hunt down. We're going to say uh, those guys. The protectors. Cool. Yes. Uh, these little boys are going to die for the cause. And I'm just going to truffle shuffle onto the zone. These guys are going to climb into this clown car. And then this lesser clown car is going to fly and take some riggers with him. Come, follow me for adventure. Yes. And I think we're going to hang out here. Just touching the zone so you have it. And then pop these guys on this zone so we can take both within three of my boat. Uh, do we want to just shoot at you? Probably, probably should. Probably should just be shooting as, most, as much as I can this game. That's fair. Especially before you start getting plus one to saves and all that jazz. Also fair. Biggest boy. Oop. And he's going to take the riggers that are with him. I don't think I can put any riggers into your zone there because I think you've successfully blocked getting within nine of you. Basically all the way around, well, so he's just going to sit at 9, wherever that is. Uh, he's going to sit at 9 over here, actually. Pretty much. He's at 9. That's With some dudes. Yep. And they're basically going to just sit on his nose here. Ready to party. And sit behind him. Also ready to party. And then we've got one more. He's gonna leave as well. Where are you going? You're going this way. You wanna head with the crowd. Do what the cool kids do. So he'll hang out over here as well. Uh, 
he'll hang out. We just want to do more damage up the middle, I think. So we'll just hang out there. And that's what we're doing. Gun the clock. Uh, we're gonna hand out some re-rolls, I think. The boats all re-roll if they shoot them. But that's about it. So no, nah, never mind. We're not gonna hand any of that out. We're gonna just start shooting. He's gonna get re-roll ones to hit. Captain's gonna say that Kay. for the ironclad. Uh, and we're gonna start with this little guy, cannon at them, and then lesser guns at them. Okay. Cannon's gonna do d6 shots. Minus one. Is it hit? how many shots? Yeah, I just minus one to hit. Why? Because the protectors. Oh, just shooting at them yep. is minus one. Yep. Okay. They, they knock things over the air. Fours. One hit. Threes. One minus one. Minus one, so four boss becomes five plus. Nope. Two damage. Take one left. Two shots into these guys. Threes and fours. One minus one. Uh, so there you've got no warding lantern, so four plus goes to five plus. Uh, take two damage. One, one, gun. Damage. one, one damage. damage. One damage? Yeah. Ow. And there. Last of guns there. Okay. How many shots from the cannon? Four. Hitting on fours. Rerolling ones. Nothing. Threes. Nothing. And then two pistol leaders, two hits, one wound minus one. So five up. We're good. Shoot at the liberators as well. So the character, what should we call it? The thunders. gunners inside, thunders, yep. Yeah. So 12 shots from them, threes and fours. And the liberators? Yeah. Twos and a one. And then fours. Two, four, five, six. Minus Six ones. minus ones, so it's going to be five zero rolling ones. That was a good roll. Mm, half, so three. Him and him. Nine. Nine shots from these dorks into the liberators as well. Threes. Not not so great. Fours. One. Minus uh, one. Minus one. Five zero three rolling ones. Nope. One damage. Another damage. And uh, these guys, same target. They're carbine on fours. And then. Three hits. Uh, fours, two, two minus ones. Last one. Five zero only ones. Nope. One damage each. So dead and it takes a wound. And then they're pistols, threes. And then fours. One, minus one. Fives again. Three only ones. Nope. Kills this guy. Mm -hmm. I would have just taken these front two guys off and no one would be able to shoot me. Them? 12 shots from the shooters in here. Yeah. Hitting on threes. Ones and twos going away. Moving on fours. Two, four, four. Four? four minus ones. Fives. One, uh, two, one. Three. One, two, three. So we'll kill this guy and do a wound. Guys, shoot them. Uh, so their main gun on fives because nice one hit. hit. Yep. Okay. And then six pistols on fours because minus one hit. One, two, three, four, and then fours again. Three at minus one. Three five saves. Take two. So it kills him and he's got one wound left. Yep, that's right. Yes. They're gonna shoot those hammer guys because they look pretty scary. The range? Eighteen. Is that within 10? Yeah, you're good. 18, yeah. Threes! Rat a tat a tat. And then fours. And then fours at minus ones. One, two, three, four, five, six minus ones. Hey, that was pretty good. On fives. Pass one. So you gun down a guy. And then two damage on another one. Mm-hmm. Down one. Gun. Uh, so he has the sky hook, which is a okay weapon. Uh, how many wounds do they have? Two each or three? These guys, two each. Two. Skyhook into them. Okay. And then everything else into the liberators. Okay. So skyhook on a three rerolling ones. Hits. And on a two. Wounds. Minus two. Sixes. Six damage. One, two. The group in the back here. These guys. So yep. three guys. Shovel am. And then into these guys with the carbines on threes, re-rolling ones. Not very good. And then on threes, one, two, three, four, minus one. These are two damage apiece. Four minus ones? Four minus ones. Uh, dead? Six. No, no, sorry, that was these guys. These oh, guys. sorry. 
That was these guys? Yeah. Four at minus one? Yes. So three get through? So six damage on them. So one, two, three. These guys? And then a wound carries over. And then the torpedoes on them. Four is re-rolling ones. Two. And then threes. Two more minus ones on them. Uh, one. Reroll ones? Oh. Nope. D3. One. Kills this guy. Fuck. Big guy is going to charge them. Uh, 2d6 plus two. Ten. Ten. You got him. With the ram. And then I have ogre charges. So for the charge roll on four pluses, you take mortal wounds. Okay. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Four pluses of mortal wounds. One, two, three, four. Okay, so this guy does. And this guy's got one left. Plus for D3 more. Gets it. For two more mortal wounds. Kills him. He's got two wounds left. And that then... means you can't use your bombs now. My phase. You're not within an inch, so no, I can't bomb I'm gonna... Sorry, yeah, go ahead. You can't bomb me out. Go what ahead. You, do? you can buy one. Nothing. You're fine. Okay. Uh, we are going to spend one command point to reroll hits of one for our um, captain. Sure. And we'll pile in. And then Capitan is going to swing his stick, hitting on threes. They all hit. Wounding on twos. Two of them at minus one, or minus two. Two at minus two. So two yeah. six ups. And two damage each. So this guy dies. And then he's got one left. one left. We're just gonna target, I guess, your general. Okay. With a special mace. I do D3 model wounds. Yep. Huh. Take one. Engine rigger hitting on threes. Three mortal wounds. Okay, he's dead. Any Stormcast died this this first game. Right? <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna spend one CP for Lord of the Host. Everyone within 24 is mean to battle shot. Uh, you can't turn off any objectives until we see you go second next round. Oh, it's second. Four, four. Yeah. And it's four, three. Let's see, let's see who's going. Big numbers, no whammy. Get him, flip boys. Two. two. I'll take it. Well, I get one CP, two plus for the general. Nope. And then five plus for the heroes. No. So I get one CP. Go to three. Events. All right. Well. We need a big turn here, fellas, and that's what we're gonna do. We're going to hit the sky with lightning. We're gonna do call the storm on a seven. Yes. It might not actually go off. Everything on the table on a six plus. That guy? Yes, D3. Take one. Uh, that truck? No. The guys inside? No. Floaters? No. Other floaters? No. Other truck? No. Those floaters? Forgot no. here. Uh, big, truck. <laughs> big truck. Unit inside the big truck. Captain. Captain the first. This is what matters. Repair nope. guy. And then repair guy. No. no. The units, the potential was there. It's pretty cool. Uh, I think we're going to warding lantern the same units. And we start doing the move thing. Big fella, you need to get some work done. So you're going to go far. Oh, we'll just move you first. You can walk five. Head up to the zone. You can walk five. Head up to the zone. You can walk, I think you go 10. This far and that far. They'll forfeit their move. He's gonna run. Nine plus three is 12. I'm six a and six. <laughs> I'm touching the zone. Uh, oh, you wanted to do something with your banner. You wanted to call the meteor down. I'm within uh, 2d6, so I think I go like this and hope to roll high. Oh, you're gonna risk not getting I'm gonna, it. I'm gonna risk not getting it. I'm gonna go within seven, so I'm gonna go here. So how far are these apart? So I think this is like five inches probably. Yeah. Uh, they're 13 apart. If they're, yeah, so if they're 12, no, they're 12 apart. I'm pretty sure. These two units. So no, how, how far between the greater, two They're greater than 12. I don't, okay. Yeah, so so you, if I roll a five or better, I hit him. If I roll a seven or better, I'm going to hit all of these two. Let's see what I got. I got a five. So I'm just going to hit him. Okay. So uh, the repair guy takes two. The guy already wounded takes one. The boat... Takes two. Takes two. And then the uh, um, squad. Squad. Takes two. This will be really good, but it wasn't. <laughs> and I forgot that's in my hero phase, not in my shooting phase like the other ones are. Uh, he needs to move. Uh, he can run actually, because he's not going to bother charging. And he'll go five and three is eight. And uh, not quite be able to touch that zone. We'll run these liberator. Oh, sorry, which zone's locked out? He's your second player. 
Isn't it the end? No, it's the start of the, the, the second battle round. Because oh. you were the second player. I see. Well, that one for sure. This one for sure. Okay. Liberators. They go eight. And we'll start going this way. Everybody's just going to turn left at Albuquerque. This guy. With that encounter, she's going to go seven. Go in the zone. Uh, these guys might as well run because they're not charging this turn. And they go nine. So eight and an inch. Archers are, yeah, archers are sitting still uh, for the plus one. And the shooting time, let's shoot, uh, I guess, this thing. Nah, nah. Okay, uh, so there's just two guys. Uh, the prime, they're all on twos right now because they forfeit their move to hit. And then this one turns into d6. So three total on threes to wound. Oops. Threes to wound. Just one. Nice one. God's going to pick a point right here <laughs> for his fiery breath. Uh, and then every unit within, I think it's three inches. Four plus, each unit takes D3 mortal wounds. So the boat. Nope. Uh, General is wounded. Yes. Takes D3 mortal wounds. Takes oh, three. Down to one. Uh, repair guy isn't hit. And then the unit is hit. For one. And... I think it's charge o'clock, yeah. Let's go big Tempestus hammer fella. Four? I guess you're gonna CP that. Who is this? This guy. Oh, okay. And make it. Ten will do it. Ten will do it. Do I wanna go far left? Or do I wanna go deep into this? They're just goblins. You Learn other people's Kill pants. almost everything you touch, but you're gonna they're gonna go after this. Or do we kill the big boat? We try and kill the big boat. Do you kill it? I think I do. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, yeah. Is it mortals? Nope. Uh, he's gonna charge. Yeah. Five. Nah. He's gonna fail. Uh, do I want to use one of my command points? I do. <laughs> That's <laughs> worse. Uh, I think we just sit still then. No. Okay. No. Nah. No, because I think he just. I think they just kill him. They do kill that guy actually. Yeah. yeah. Mm, he doesn't have the attacks to kill. Them no, all. not at all. I think we just go to fight, yeah. Over uh, here. I'm gonna spend my money to reroll my saves on my big boy. Do it. And then I'm gonna drop bombs on your dude on a two plus. Do it. Yes. Take two more wounds. Uh, okay. Left. I'm gonna take the plus two attacks, plus D3 for charging. So I get plus five, five attacks with my Tempestus hammer. Attacks. So he's gonna put those into the boss, or to, to the truck, sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, then the claws and fangs on the, the thing is gonna go on the general who has one wound left. I am hitting on threes. I am rerolling ones on the charge. And then I am wounding on twos. Oh, sorry, that's six to hit is plus one damage. Oh, we'll remember that one. So you got one, yep. one magic hit. And then wounding on twos. Three. Uh, three. And then the plus and one. And then this damage. one. Yep. Also yep. wounded. So three special one, three normal ones and a special one. So the normies, four plus re-rolling. Re-rolling. Nope. So D3. Take one. And then the D3 plus one damage one, he blocks that. I got Squaws and Fangs. These are minus one to hit because I'm a dude in a garrison. Okay, so two hits. Yep. And two wounds, minus one. Uh, so three plus. He's good. Do you have a two plus save? Plus one because I'm in a garrison. Oh, that's right. Captain. Yeah, hitting on threes, re-rolling ones because you're a character. Wounding on twos, re-rolling ones because you're a hero. Re-rolling ones. Two at minus two. Sixes. Two yep. damage each. Uh, turn to one on fives. One's a one damage hit. So three damage total? Yep. So I get down to two. Swings his bum around. Uh, it's not worth it. We'll just let the dog live. And he'll just punch you. His crew is still functioning. Hitting on force. And then force. Three normal saves. Three four ups. He has a three up save. He has a 4-up save because he put, took plus 2 attacks. He's dead. Hooray! <laughs> uh, one? I got one. Yeah. Four. Sweet. We tie it up. You hit round two. Table me. Vote for one. Plus two. So... Where's the five? Damn it. There it is. <laughs> okay. It's back to 17. Yeah. Well, you guys are going to go this way. Oh, do I get my extra command points? I just get one, and I go to two. And in hindsight, I think I probably should have charged the uh, Lord Selson to these guys and killed them. Because I probably could have killed both units. Faces are coming on over this way. Mr. Boat floats ten, and he's going to just 
ride on up into to the, the zone. Middle. Um, just answer a three on that. Wherever, yeah, yeah, whatever three is. Drop some folks off, yeah. Let's go, Rifleman. Get tactical. Yeah, get tactical, Marines. <laughs> Let's get answer a three and just float around the zones. If I kill the guy who gave them the lantern, does the lantern go away? Uh, I think its effect lasts till the end of the round. Oh, okay, it's not like while he's around? No, it's an effect. It's like okay. a spell effect. Spells don't just suddenly end either if the wizard dies. This guy? I guess. <laughs> I guess we're just going in here, boys. <laughs> Let's do it. Uh, we're going to pick these guys as our reroll target. Sweet. For the escorts and the big ship. And we're on to shooting. Do I want to spend any gold? He's going to spend his gold to reroll all wound rolls. And then he's going to open up into these guys. Uh, I'm not minus one to hit, so hitting on a three, big cannon shell. Rerolling ones because they're my target. Hits, winning on twos. Does it, minus two. Into this big glob. Real ones. <laughs> nope. D6 damage. One. Bam! Just just <laughs> injures a guy slightly. Ow! Lesser guns. Uh, they miss. He's gonna fire into them as well. Uh, he'll do D6 shots with his main gun for six. Hitting on threes, re-rolling ones, and then wounding on threes, two at minus one. Two at minus one, so two four of re-rolling ones. That nah, potato. Re-rolling re ones. Uh, two so damage. two damage, so this guy takes a wound and this guy dies. One hit, re-rolling ones, two hits, fours, one at minus one. Nope. One. Oh, sorry, yeah, minus one, one, this guy dies. Deck boys. Same thing, four, six, four, and the big gun. This is on the big liberator yet? Yeah. Hitting on threes, rerolling ones. One little skull. Two goes away. And then wounding on fours. One, two, three, potato, four, five. Five, so five minus one. Yep. So plus one for the lantern, minus one for the gun. So four zero rolling ones with their shields. We roll one. So three wounds. So one more dies, and another one takes wounds. The guy outside the zone. And we'll wound, I guess, him. <laughs> Not my grip hound. Why would you do that? Rifle on fours. Not the goodest boy. Ha! On a four. One, one. Ha! And then takes a wound. Three pistols, they finish three. them off. And then fours. How dare you. One. Mine's one. Ah! I think he might live. <laughs> oh, wrong. He's just dead. Yeah. Smaller Daka into the big squad, I guess. Pistols. Threes and fours. No rerolls of any kind. And fours. Two. Minus ones. Two at minus one. Fours. Reroll ones. Oh, uh, no. Nope. Just kills this guy. Is he gonna shoot this guy? <gasps> no, it's not the single prime. Finish him. Maybe not. Prime Force. time? Nothing. Yay! And then they're bigger guns. He's the bravest. Two hits and fours. One minus one on him. Live! He's yes. gonna go down the paladins. They're just they're just gonna kill? I mean you might. I wish I had an ability to spend gold over there, because I would have done it. Uh hitting on threes. Not rolling like that, you're not. And then fours. Come back here. One, two, three. Minus ones. Three minus ones. Fives. Kills again. Pow, pow, pow. You gotta take some. You got two left. Bam. Okay, sir. Uh, floating crew is gonna shoot this guy. If I only gotten slightly better comets and lightning, all those guys would be dead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, these are all the rifles. Just trying to kill that Stormcast. One, two, three minus ones. Three minus ones into just the big unit? No, no, just this person. Just that guy. Fives. We got it. He rerolls ones! Oh. He's only got one wound. Doesn't matter. No. <laughs> Here's the Garni into the Judicators. Hits. Hits. Oh, that might be. But does he stare hard enough? Is it a three or a two? Probably not a two. Two minus one. They didn't move though. They're Here fine. You. They're stare proof armor. Captain's gonna shoot them with his pistol. How dare you? Uh, threes and fours? Yep. 
Nothing. Nothing. Laughs. And in then cast. the ship itself is going to shoot. Uh oh. Uh, I think it's just all in on the liberators. Do it. Main gun. Threes. Twos. One at minus two. Uh, plus two. So fours are rolling ones. Plus one, right? Uh, Warding land. Oh, they moved. That's right. Uh, so fives are rolling ones. So six. Six. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, one, two, three. Rifles. Uh, we're rolling ones. Twos go away. Nope. And then threes. Four at minus one. Okay. You're gonna be fine. Fours. Uh, we roll that one, or you're dead. Okay. <laughs> Wasted. Charge. Everything's going great. Uh, is charge. Oh, little boat. Goes six. Uh, other little boat. Goes eight. I'm sure I'll be fine. Uh, squad of dudes that don't have a gun. Goes 11. Ugh, you can go all the way over into the night if you want. Charging. Big numbers. Six. Are we it's okay enough. with that? Oh, yeah. Uh, I get. Oh, oh impact hits. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We're going to just. Uh, we're going to slap our bum on all both right. of these. Okay. And uh, we're going to impact. So then impacts for him and then start of the combat grenades. Mm hmm. So we're gonna do eight hits on them on fours. Yep. Six hits, you mean? Is it plus right. two? I have plus two for my ram. Or oh. my, uh, my drill. The, the plus big gun. The number. Got it, yeah. got it, got it. So fours. One, two, three, three. Three. Okay, so this Lives. guy's got a one left. Engine Master, his two plus to do more. Yes. Kills the last guy. Takes another one. Bam. And it's driven over. The bombing begins. Start of the phase, so four plus. No. Four plus. Yes. Four. Three on Bannerman. Sweet, he's got two left. And then big bombs onto Lady with Stick. Two plus. Four. Three. She's down to two. And then combat. Uh, these dinguses are gonna go. I'll start the combat phase. Oh, are, you, yeah. are you fighting yet? I'm about to fight now. I'm breaking all my vials to do three mortal wounds to everything within three of her. <laughs> okay. So Just kills both your characters, or one. kills one of your characters. Okay. So it dies. Okay. <laughs> but it'll yeah. kill one and a half of them and put three on this thing. And also kill him. <laughs> and also put him down to two. Fight. But now your general's dead at least. I'm just doing this to feel better because I don't think anything else is going to happen right now. <laughs> uh, threes to hit from those little dudes. Look at this! Look at that. How did that even end up like that? That was crazy. <laughs> it's still on its side. Yeah! Eat it! He fights back and kills this thing. He will use the celestial command trait to give himself plus one attack. And he'll stab... I don't know. He fights two inches. He'll go towards the nearest guy. This is this guy, because he was almost touching him. Oh, you're gonna get closer to the bone? I'm, I'm gonna stab the guy in silent yeah. wounds, uh, and we'll, we'll all attack with him. Uh, why the hell not? Yeah, we'll all attack with him. Start the combat phase. Miss. And one at minus one. Ah. Die! Dies. Oh. There we go. I feel great vindication. <laughs> and now you can kill me with the boat. It's gonna try. <laughs> Run you over. Eight, eight boat punches. Now as you do. Force. And fours. Ha! Two normal saves. Two three ups. We're laughing. And then four more boat punches. Not a chance. He stands, he fights. Two more. And nothing. Yay! And crew in here. That's it. One two, oh, one's one. a captain. Yep. And then fours. One more normal save. Ha! He lives. I'll shock over here. We're okay. Score one, two, three, four. Five. Five. Nine. And I have four models left at the top of three. Do you double around me? Just to finish it. Spin on his ground. Finish it. Four. Yes. yes. Of course you do. Uh, <laughs> what are you going to do now? What are you going to do now? We don't get our free command points. So yeah. Just I kill all your heroes. I don't even care what happens now. <laughs> I have four models dun, left. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, Stormcast. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> you make me laugh. There we go. Go get them. Dun, 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 uh, yeah, that's it. I mean, do you need more than just these three guys to kill my two wound hero? Probably not. We're gonna see if we can big gun every okay. gun into a okay. big gun. Hits, wounds minus two, fives, six damage. Shoots whatever you want. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, I lock out this one for spite. I said that, but I don't even care. I'm just going to do it. Still hold on. So it's not that. <laughs> it didn't really matter. Rifles. Do it. Take them down, boys. Quite have done a little better. I mean, there's only eight wounds there. One, two, three, four. Let's take away four of them. Four. Minus ones. Minus ones? Mm, one. Ha. Three Radiant. rolling ones. Yeah. Just no go ones. away, and then... Fours. One, two, minus ones. Two minus ones, fives. No nope. more. And this guy dies, and this guy's got two ones left. Again? Fours. If you can't wipe this unit out, I'm going to laugh at you. Take another one. Minus one. Fives. Nope. Down to one. And then the pistols. Threes. Come on. One, two. More. Minus ones. You laugh. Dead. And this guy has two ones left. And can't do it! D6 shots. You can't do it! For five. I'm gonna Willem Dafoe at the end of Platoon. Threes. <laughs> Three rolling ones because he hates that guy. And he does hate that guy. And then threes. He's got two ones left. One. Ha! One. He laughs. Wins. Two hits. One wound. No. Oh, oh, oh. oh, down to one. And then he charges. No! Oh, go, yeah, go, go! Don't you dare. Eight. Eight. He makes it. <laughs> and also these guys charge because the boat might not do it. Sure. They go away. I think the boat does with its impact. It's just with the bombs on four. Yeah. Get that sweet, sweet four plus. Yes. Dead. <laughs> Bottom of three. Sorry, top of three. I'm tabled. You score another uh, four and go to. I was at nine. Twelve. So nine. Thirteen. Thirteen to four. End of the game. Liberator's great again. I don't think so. I mean, it makes them cool. An extra rock is kind of good if I could still take the Rome rocks and stuff like that. Or artifacts, rather. Um, I wish they would realize that stand still and get a bonus is uh, hot garbage. Is trash, yes. Yeah. In a game, in a game where you have to move. So even even if we replayed my first turn differently, I had to go in the zones. Because you're just going to take them from me otherwise. I can't let you score six. So I have to move with somebody. And that means that the reroll, like the defensive tech doesn't really do anything until at least at earliest turn two. And, and if I'd gone second, you would have shot me. And I wouldn't be in the zones, he would have grabbed all the zones. So I kind of had to move up, and I lost half my army. Would this charge have been better off going a different direction? Probably. I was just, I was trying to do something to take care of this, and I'd really hoped that my, um, my Comet and Stormbreath combo was going to melt those characters and blow them, blow them out of the unit. Because that was, a, that was a, a big potential that just didn't quite work for me. Um, the, uh, the... Liberators themselves, we were just talking about this off camera, they're so, they're, they're so like penalized by being on 40 mil bases, because it means that you can't get as many models into a zone, you're spread out as far as like where your attacks can reach, so like, let's look at these 30 mil bases versus these two 40 mil bases. This is, if this was the same amount of Stormcast, or let's say just Chaos Warriors, I can't get the same number of attacks in. You get four guys to my three, right, just from like a zoning point of view. Yep. And then it's way harder for me to fight through the divots. You can fight through the divots on yours and be within an inch. I can't fight through the divots on mine. I have to actually spread out to get my one inch engagement. And now that just spreads me out further. Right? So you can literally lockstep and usually get your one inch engagement range. I have to go like this to do the same thing. So when we compare like Liberators to Chaos Warriors, let's say, they have the exact same style line for the most part, four plus save. But they have so much built-in better tech. If you take 15 or 20 of them, you're rerolling all your saves until you're down to nine guys. Mm -hmm. Even just a 10-man unit rerolls all its saves until you, you lose them a guy. shields, and they have a five-up mortal wound truck. Yep, but you just give them double hand-up, and so they reroll their misses all the time. <laughs> I mean, I think there's an argument for the shields. No, um, I don't think there is. I don't think there's ever anything better than rerolling because if I if I have to if I'm trying to shrug off damage. Like, it's not as good as killing more. I'd rather kill oh, you than, 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 than have to, like a thing that only works against mortal wounds. It's not a wound shrug, it's a mortal yeah. wound shrug. Mortal wounds have become really ubiquitous, though. That's sure. the only thing. I mean, you can make a defensive unit, too. I'm just talking about purely from, like, a I get free stat buffs for just being alive. Yeah. <laughs> right? Rerolling ones to save versus just if I take a big unit that I'm going to take anyway because I'm on 32 mil bases, so I have the advantage of being able to pile on attacks. Yep. I, I just I'm better in every way if I'm a cast warrior. Plus like my mark my mark makes me better, right, for free. 
I like that the Chaos versus Liberator argument is the reverse of the 40k Primaris versus Space Marine. It is, literally. Like, the bad guys are just better in this so, case. Well, it's, yeah, it's just the opposite. Yeah. yeah, and Slaves of Darkness don't have a lot going on, but Chaos Warriors are fantastic. Like, they are great battle line choices that just, they carry most of their stat buffs with them and are just generally really, I mean, really good. I do have 90 Chaos Warriors in the painting pile. That's right. This is, this is Chaos, <laughs> this is, we're going to test and see how obnoxious this is. And they're 5th edition Chaos Warriors, so they're never ranking up to play 5th uh, edition anyway. They're bigger than their 32. They're, they're very enormous. They used to be on 25s. <laughs> right. and they used to be on, yeah, on 25s. They used to be on tiny square bases. So I don't know. I don't, I don't think this makes Liberators particularly attractive. Um, the problem is that you can't stand still. Not like, in this if, game, either. If they all yeah. had guns, there's an argument. But yep. without guns, you're literally like, oh, I'm just going to get punished. Like, okay, I have a shooting army, so you're doubly wound. Like, you don't get... Yes, I have to chase you no matter what. And it means I'm not going to go into melee against you. So your ability to stand still is really bad because you're yep. just doing nothing while I shoot at you instead of fighting back while I fight you. Right. Um, but, like... The game is a movement game. It is. It's a, well, it's a stand in places game, right? That's the that's the whole definition of AOS. So, having a, having a storm host and losing the fact that you can deep strike, like if I could mix that those two abilities, still be able to deep strike and make me have my liberators be good. Like if there was a liberator, if this was, if it was a liberator battalion, j instead of being like its own replace your general army traits ability thing, yeah. it might have seen the liberators get a little bit better. But still, I think just you just go with. The sequiturs, they're just better in every way. <laughs> like, I mean, I like it for your range guys. That's the thing though, like plus one to hit and plus one save on all your archers. Yeah, it's cool. Um, like if you But can... I could just take sequiturs and I can still take them and they're still great. They still hit on threes and threes and the prime still hits on twos with d6 hits, you know what I mean? That's like, fair. They're not terrible no matter what. I'm thinking um, of the other potential archer choices you have that are like, like the bolt throwers. Can you put them in there? No. Oh. Nothing else can go in there. It's just this unit. Like it's, it's just this cool. unit. It's Paladins, uh, judica like the Judicators can go in, any of the Paladin units can go in, and Liberators. That's it. It doesn't affect any other units in the army. Nobody else can do it. It's Never designed mind. to make these units more attractive. So we can't mix and match it anywhere else. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> yep. So it doesn't, that argument unfortunately doesn't work. Don't move to get a bonus to units that move four inches a turn, like the Paladins. Yes. Isn't fantastic. So we go into the game, round three, and yeah, the Caradron Overgobs just, just dumpstered my four storm cast <laughs> so anyway we'll see you for more games in the future hopefully i'll be able to get kristen to try out the new marathi uh so you can see that with the daughters of cain and maybe at some point we'll even get to try out the new cities of sigmar mixed with some dark elves so maybe thanks for watching until then i'm ash i hope you enjoyed that video if you uh want to support the channel of course like and subscribe and hit the little bell below so you get notifications when i post future content i do post stuff seven days a week uh if you want to support the channel um further you can of course buy a t-shirt through Spreadshirts, um buy a measuring gauge or objective markers from Death Designs. Um, or of course, most importantly, there is Patreon. Patreon is what makes all this possible. Uh, keeps the lights on, pays for the studio costs, pays for the equipment, model costs, and everything else. And most importantly, um, puts food in my kids' bellies and a roof over their heads. Uh, big thanks to everyone past, future who supported me. Uh, I do this stuff because of you guys. And of course, I will continue doing it as long as I can.